Alright, alright, hallo, hallo. So, man of Madan. Or Midan, uh, Madan, I don't know. You can tell me. Anyway, another story time. Let's see where, what is this about. Uh, it's gonna be a new story. Uh, let's give me challenging. New save data and a new story only because of I have started this game already, but I couldn't finish. So I think it's best to do a fresh start. Buster, we better mosey on back to the ship. <coughs> Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Let's have it. What's in store for me, Pop? Okay, uh let's be uh, curious. About my son? Will he uh is he gonna grow up all right? Things gonna work out for him? Get the bamboo. Can Jay can do the Okay. It a fish. It looks like a fish. Death. Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? Let me get a go at it. Oh yeah? Think you got the stuff? Fine, sure. Let me know the quarter. Gonna start a tab. I'll give it a whirl. Alright. Time to fail this thing.
What the hell? Have a nice day. Hey, Chuck, we better get back to the ship. We don't want to get stranded. Come on, man, just let me ask another question. We really need to get back. Looks like someone is able to push him around. What is that water in there? It wasn't there. You're kidding me. They're going to be re reanimated by the lightning. What is that substance? What the hell is happening? That's the sun. The pops come back soon. What the? What the hell? What is going on? Hmm. Okay, that's a very shit start. How 
Howdy, Charlie. How's your time off? Just get me out of here already. What the hell's going on up there? Heard aircraft and gunfire. Me too. And there was a... a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. What the hell? I think the guy went crazy a bit. What the hell? Duh. What was that? Let's see what do we have here. Fuck. Let's just come back. Oh, damn it. Buckley. Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Okay, nothing that way. Bloody jump scare. Did you see that kid over there? Uh, no. You feeling all right? What the hell is happening here, seriously? Hey, come here. 
I hit kids in the horror horror games. What? That's Joy or who the hell is? That's his son. Oh, he's having a knife. Ah, oh, does not work. What the heck? Okay, his heart. Okay. Oh, ho, 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 ho. A spider thing, or what the heck is that? Another one by the dust. All right, that's a good start. Won't you spare me over till another year? Hello, people. There goes our friend in a hard hat. I think he's the eagle. Hey, Bruno. Nice to see you, my man. Como se va? Did you like the video what uh, La Chocol was sending to you? Good, good, good. All is well. Nice. Wow. I'm kind of recovering now. I was sick. I'm still sick. But other, otherwise, everything fine. Got some silly stubborn cold. <coughs> Well, I hope as well, but I don't have a choice. I need to go to work on Monday. So I, was, I was on holiday this week. Not a pleasant one, but at least. Hello. Here is our Welcome friend. To my repository. I am curious what's going to be the end of the story. I had maybe ten hectoliters of tea with honey. 
Even I have it now, right now. Greed and beauty, life and death. The story <coughs> is this one. I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices <sighs> you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue oh, to yeah. flourish. Oh, yeah. It helps a lot. They are Definitely a lot. Out. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral compass. And we have to live with those decisions or die by them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes eventually to everybody. Still, none of us want for it to come too soon, do we? Yeah, that's true. I don't want to come. I don't want it to come too soon. As in life. The actions you take matter. The choices you make will affect others. I'll be keeping a close eye on your progress. It's not my place to interfere, but I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. Here's one for free. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. Have you ever played you this game or uh, them, any of this? They may just help you to make better decisions. Or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. That's all for the moment. These are we'll quite good. Soon enough, I would we'll say, if, if you like stories, account, a kind of interactive movie. Taken, That's how I'm approaching this thingy. Made. Oh, here is the chance now. <laughs> But maybe there are better, better uh, players. I think after this, I'm gonna play uh, either Until Dawn or the newest uh, installment, which is The Devil in Me. Witty, Brad, Innocent, or whatever was that. So we're gonna go for some uh, trip. Insecure, Brad's brother, Julius, boyfriend, motivated. Think we got enough? Ah, uh, you are uh, nice. <laughs> so, uh, look, I've never been down there before. Down? The water, diving. Charisma. How the pros do it. That's one of my favorite words. Uh, yeah? I mean, are you serious you came out here with Because it's actually a part of kind that of, uh, yeah. charisma meaning, having the same meaning, like in English, but that's exactly the same pronunciation as like the arm, the muscle of the well, arm anyway, in Hungarian. Let's get this all loaded up. Charisma. Whoa, careful. That dive cam is like super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? <clears throat> Julia and Conrad are, you know... How do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Uh, pa -pa -pa. I was invited. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Julia wanted you to come along. <laughs> For real? Julia? Yeah, man. She wanted you to come. And I wanted her to see how cool you are, which you're not. So be cool. Capiche? All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. The guy wants to be Sorry, cool, but I think he's the least cool. The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Mm. Let's be yeah, empathetic. Must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. All right. Envious. Hey. So uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah. What? Just uh. I really wonder how many people I can about save. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a 
big life choice, you know? How to know what's the right thing to do. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. All right. Uh, I did not approve it, but hey. who cares? This is Julia. Reckless. Conrad. Relaxed. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. <laughs> hey, man. Want to crack a colon with me? Every second. Huh. Uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would have gone with minutes. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah. Cool. Hey, hello, hello. Uh, I, I love beer. Finally here, eh? <laughs> Sup in Skyrim? I like the cut of your ship. It's Jib. Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Yeah. Totally. All the time. Nice. I was worried they're gonna stick me with a noob. Oh, uh, nope. Not noob. I can practically breathe underwater at this point. <laughs> so you uh, dive a lot? A couple, three times, you know, here and there, family trips. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who the hell is that guy? It's just Where's game. Where's bucket skipper anyhow? Uh, that guy is a girl. Okay, courageous captain of the Duke of Milan. Impatient. Nice. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but uh... so is everybody on board and ready to go? Ah, uh, the boss is here. <laughs> Okay, she's a strong and independent female, looks like. Or strong and table, stable. <laughs> Not table, stable. I don't know what I'm talking about. Maybe I just should shut up. <laughs> That's it, get it all out. Uh, yeah. You uh, wanna go lie down? Yeah, you know, maybe I should. But we still can breathe underwater at this point. Or maybe not. God knows. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just... But even better when you're able nice to be table. <laughs> uh, optimistic. If he says a wreck's here, it's here. Okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? So we're going to try to find something. Maybe that old military ship. Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right That's on not going to be Always good. Bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Okay, say nothing. Guys, no one knows, no one cares. No harm, no foul. The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. 
The problem is, if you go down, take a look, everything goes sideways. Who's gonna know? One down there. Can you imagine? Untouched. We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Right out. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Okay, let's check on him. Probably he's dying. Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Took more than that just to screw up the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. All right. Okay, so these ones are gonna be the premonitions, high and dry. Hi. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Uh, yeah. Sorry about before. Everybody. I don't know if I try to play nice. We've been planning this whole thing for a while. How much does it gonna it. affect? But there are rules and the laws outcome. and customs. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? I've dived a couple wrecks over the years. I'm expert, but you know, experienced. If this is your first unreported wreck, then you should know there's a very specific protocol you have to follow. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Fine. I get it. How much? How much what? Oh. How much money will it take for you to stop breathing down her necks? You... This is not about the money. You know what? I can't stop you. Just respect the rules down there. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. You know how to use that? Uh, no. No. <laughs> not really. But I can switch it off. Just let it do its thing. doesn't look kosher. Okay. I thought he's going to take it. Hey, hey. Hey, sweetie. There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Oh, yeah. There it is. <coughs> okay. So we can go in either at the tail probably or on the side I don't know what the heck is that oh 
Varētu. Tad es nuku cilā. Hey guys. Okay. So, this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water and instead it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. Stay yeah, there. probably something like that. Okay. O2 check done. This must be something like that. Whoa, 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 beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. <laughs> Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate. Okay. Well, I take the bottle. I got the bang stick. Yeah, I heard that about you. All right, kids. Ha uh ha. -huh. Good to go. You ever have to use one? On a shark? Just remember no. the rules, please. You're on camera. I'll take the wheels. Let's get a before photo. Cheese. Okay, Julia was looking a wee bit strange. Strange. Hey, hello. Hello, bro. All right. As we say, now the monkey going to jump into the water. Ah, a shark. I think the bottom was a good idea. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. These mimics. <laughs> yeah, but. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is. Wow. It's better than on most games. It's pretty intact too. This is a fucking remarkable. But the most interesting is the story anyway. I think. Okay, am I not allowed to see what is happening down there? You fancy a pint with your second in command? You? Are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Uh, I need to focus. Pass. Sorry. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? You know it's not polite to ask a lady about her money. Fair enough. I was just thinking about buying a boat myself, and I thought maybe you'd like to point me in the right direction. It would be my singular pleasure to help you part with your money. <laughs> okay, something is happening. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Weather looks clear. Okay. Oh, wait. There is something. Uh, she did not pay the installments. Okay. That's too bad. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. 
You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Alex plays the goof, but he was pretty serious about acing his... I think a boat is ex expensive everywhere. What are their dice? What are their dice have they done? When I got the booking, I thought they were newbies. Alex and Julia have both logged plenty of dives. I'm the real amateur. But I'm ready. But oh, probably I never would buy a boat. Check I'm not seaworthy. Okay, we have nothing here. Hey! Okay, there is another picture. Why do I keep these around? What the hell was that? We might going to have some pirates. Well, nothing. Hey there, how's it hanging? You can monitor the dive while I do some boat maintenance. Not a problem, Bob. So are you beached? Like a whale? Hey, I just thought, why spend all my time down in the dark when I already like what I see up top? <laughs> <laughs> nice one. How long you been cooking that one up? All afternoon. Good use of your time. I like to make the most of it. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. Oh, yeah. I think that's kind of crazy. What the heck is happening there? Wow, that is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. I don't know if there is anything you have to notice on these pictures. God knows. Okay. I think I have done every maintenance I had to do, so I don't know what is. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. What the hell? Why they don't answer? Weather looks clear. Okay, what else I have to do? Hey, okay. Look, there's a boat. What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? <clears throat> Who the hell are these guys? Guys, you gotta keep back, we've got divers in the water. Here, you see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like uh, ten bucks cover it? 
Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it 20. What the hell? Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. This guy's an idiot. He just insulted the man. Okay. I think we are going to pay the price for this. Don't fucking move. You're dead. Just stay dead. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really? The rear turret. Huh. Good on you, Connie. The yeah, probably. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's the opening at the tail. Oh, that was close. Careful. Could be dangerous. Uh, ladies first. Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. But there was something. Okay, why the hell? Okay, there we go. A bullet. Bullet holes. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Okay, there is another thing. Just saw something shiny. I don't know, the control feels a wee bit off. Why I can't move? Don't touch him. Don't. Well, we should, is it? Ugh. Ugh. He's ah. I don't know. Uh, you hear that? Hear yeah, what? Don't drop it. Why did she drop it? Oh, that guy going to shoot us down. Ah! Whoa, whoa. Bastard! I think ah, my heart! <laughs> ah, sorry. Ah, oh, my goodness. 
plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we shall move it, of course. Okay. <laughs> Did you miss it? <laughs> He's holding something. We already saw that. Why the guy is not coming? Okay, I don't know why, why he's just not moving. Well, I don't care. I hope she doesn't want Julia, to go in there. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Maybe it is kind of dangerous. Yeah, but better to leave it. I don't want to risk it. We gotta get out of here now. I think that was a good decision. <gasps> Would you marry me? That's that's what is right coming time. up. I, I don't. I guess. Oh. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh huh. Julia, will you marry me? You're shitting me, right? What? <laughs> like you there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh. <laughs> okay, <laughs> come out, guys. The gig is up. Julia. I'm serious. Okay, be loving. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? Yes, yes, I'll marry the shit out of you. <laughs> All right, handsome hero. You want to get on with our escape from the uh, crumbling death trap? Fliss, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where's that other boat come from? Wait, Julia. We gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta the heck? There. Wait, we have to decompress. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. Yeah. Oh my god, this is taking too long. This is torture. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now. Go, go! Hey, what the hell is going on? What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's alright now. Okay, they just made the bloody barbecue. Mishap. 
with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done. <laughs> Come up and let's celebrate. And then maybe get the hell out of there. Because I think those fishermen's will be back. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad, a bold fellow, you might say? Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. <laughs> Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. Good. Looks like I'm, I'm doing well. If the storyteller says, I must be. So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball... Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Well, needless to say, this lady was impressed. Yeah, well played there, man, no? Wasn't Conrad gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Of course. So, how He's to soon be willing to check it out. Julia Smith? Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel. But now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So, I guess we should talk about wedding plans. Eventually. Now you're speaking my language. Been taking lessons. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait for us to plan everything together. All the reason I did not say the dead thingy because I think he would not appreciate it. Of course I was gonna say yes, you dimwit. I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. Let's make a love story. I love you, Alex. Where did everyone go? There was much celebration to be had. I'll go find them. You just relax. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. So, which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens? What <laughs> the fuck he's talking about? What's your problem? Give it a rest already. Okay, that's enough of that. Conrad, Beers, where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. All right. They didn't bring so much beer. I still wouldn't be enough for an hour. All right, now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. So, 
How's it feel to be a man post proposal? Believe me, honestly. I've been carrying that around for a while. Why'd you do it on the dime? I wanted it to be memorable. It's not that memorable. I nice pictures. Alright. So we go again tomorrow. Still good weather. Uh yeah. It seemed a little too dangerous for my blood. Don't sweat it. This is so awesome. Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Oh, no, not yet. I got distracted. Got it. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. Easy, tiger. We should get back. Right here. You'll get no resistance there. All right, everyone, check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? What? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It oh, yeah, that was on the uh, plane. OK. Wow. You find anything else? We For a second, I did not know where they lodge, but that was about it. Reckless, get it from. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me. I'm sorry. Okay. Maybe. I, I think she's know. a true sailor. That's you why she is worried. Down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Yeah, let's hear, let's it. hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. <laughs> he of the one-track mind. The woman answers, I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. What? Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So. They go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? 
I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. Well, let's say nothing. Okay, so who did it? So the woman, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still here in the closet. Huh, the husband, eh? So is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseats. You're locked in. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. What the? Oh my goodness. Closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees it's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> so gross. Hey, old super twist. Nice. <laughs> nice one, Squire. You have me going. Pretty cool. Heavy on the cheese there, corn. Back. Okay. You missed another you scream. But not mine this time. All turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regular issues are these? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> the storm is coming. That's not gonna be good. Yeah, that wasn't mine. What the? Who the hell is this? I think these are the. This is the sailor. Oh yeah, the sailor. Uh, not the sailor, the fisherman's. <gasps> yeah. They must be. Free. 
Okay, that's definitely not good. Hey, so, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh, God damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How was that good news? I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Hey. Alex, what are they gonna do to us? I don't wanna know. I wanna get out of here. I'm in a lot of danger. Guys, we gotta get untied. Right now. <laughs> I'll be back for you later. Where the hell they're taking them? Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. Let's try to be calm, not to piss them off. Be on your best behavior, little man. Okay. Okay. What the hell? I probably would put that scissor in his face. Oh yeah, we're missing the other guy. Don't let your hands. Once we get Julia back, maybe we can take him by surprise. <clears throat> okay, they're coming. <clears throat> Fuck, motherfuckers! Hey, I think they're hey, never gonna go for okay? diving. <laughs> Ever. Fine. They didn't touch me. They asked about our parents. What? How much money they have. No, not really. Alex, I'm so sorry. What? I don't Just even know when I had almonds. Oh, 
last day. It's okay. It's okay. To wait and see what they want to do with us. I thought that's gonna be a horror story. So far, this is just a hostage. A hostage story. Storm's eight miles away. They came here on a boat. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. The main guy. He's got a gun. Well, at least one of us can get on their boat. Get some help. These fuckers need to pay. We gotta take them down. They can try to fight back, but if we had the gun, they'd be forced to surrender. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I climb out the window, climb around the side, and hit them from there. We'll take them from the other side. <coughs> That's not gonna work out. Okay, let's do it. Don't fuck it up. I ru I ruined it. Okay, who has the gun now? It's amateur hour over here. Fliss, I got this. Let me handle it. All right. How the hell am I going to get out of this? Think about what you're doing, boy. No! Just get to the boat! This kid's trying to kill me also. Yeah, probably yes. Fuck me. Wrong button again. I am so stupid. Bring them downstairs. Take this. Use it if you have to. Okay. Sit down. Over there. You, right here. Sit. No. Maybe I was supposed to just uh, run away. Arrêtez bande de con. C'est mon bateau. Stop. Ferme la ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule. Olsen. Come here. Which one of you is going to tell me about this Manchurian goon? Oh shit. I'm still missing the little brother. What the hell, man? 
You should have escaped when you had the chance. Yeah, I get it. All right, shut the fuck up! There is no harm in just talking. You wanna talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna say it. Flitz has gotta be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's the captain and they barely laid a hand on her? I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. All right, Alex is tearing the shit up. Are you out of your mind? How did you come up with this bullshit? How fucking dare you, you overprivileged asshole? You're all in this together. This was a trap, and you set us yeah, up. Yeah, so what a cork in it. Sit still, all of you. You come with me. Hey, leave her alone. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Will you try anything? Anything fishy? And there'll be consequences. Get it. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Duke, we read you. Everything okay? Over. any information about this storm you can give us? It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, hmm. Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A-OK -okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. Almost. Where's the little brother is? Thanks, I guess. Anyone know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? I don't know where he is. Okay, keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. Brad's a big bull. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. What the hell? That's the shit from the beginning. And probably all that's happening because of they brought up Everyone's that shit. Still alive. Things could have been quite different. <sighs> yeah.
He sounds a wee bit frustrated. No one has died yet. Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? Uh, I don't need it. You're going it alone. Independent. Admirable. Possibly foolish. We'll learn soon enough. Oh, yeah. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. <laughs> but here's a thing. Sorry about it. <laughs> may not be entirely as it seems. Should I kill everyone in the first half an hour? Or actually, but in a half? <laughs> Probably shouldn't have said that. Maybe the ship's ship name is Manchurian Gold? There's no way I would go in there. There's no way. Junior. <laughs> oh yeah. You can be sure about that. I definitely would not go up there. Oh, they're taking the stuff. Whatever is that? Disabling the ship to leave. I would be absolutely happy if they just leave me on the boat. Uh, nope, no thanks. They can get up on the ship, get killed, and then I can leave. Go on, keep moving. Every character I'm controlling constantly looking the, to the floor. Jeez. I did not sign up for a trip to Creek Town. The mask of madness. Do you dare to look death in the eye? Miller. Yeah, maybe, but so far there wasn't anything. What the hell do these dickheads want with us? Oh, man. Oh, shit. They're gonna lock us in. Internal memorandum to Private O'Neill. You are covering Patterson's guard duties tomorrow. He's sick again. Conven conveniently, it's always when he has guard duties in hold 3A. Again, this is the third time this week. None of us like it down there. Maybe Patterson should back up. All right.
Orson, you're in port, you see. Okay, all of you, into the room. Well, this is not really believable. Can it work like this after so many years on the sea? What the hell is this fucking place? Did that thing just uh, putting away a uh, puzzle? Dude, even those meatheads seem spooked. You think this ship is the Manchurian gold? We are in the vicinity of those coordinates. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. The second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. <laughs> yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. We gotta get back to the boat and find Brad. What happened to him? No idea. They swiped our distributor cap. Gonna be okay. difficult to get anywhere without it. So, okay, what exactly is a distributor cap? Now pretend you're talking to someone who doesn't know anything about boats. It makes the engine work. No, it, the Duke of Milan is dead in the water without it. Well, those guys Maybe those rats are David David Jones rats. If you know what I mean. We gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. Fliss, I just wanted to say that um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Uh, excuse me. I may have kind of prematurely come to the conclusion that maybe you know you're working some kind of side deal with these guys or whatever. But I, uh, I mean, that's that's not the pirate true. of the Caribbean. So. One of the yeah. Allow me villain. to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, I. Hmm. Well, you're apologizing. I think that was in the third part. Cool. The dead man cool. tells no tale. I think that was the title of the episode. Uh, they are nervous. I don't know what they are talking about, but they are nervous. So, when we told you this would be a quick adventure, I wonder why this was ripped off. Oh, nice doggy. Miss Rivera, my baby doll, I miss you like crazy. Three months until my next leave and jumping into your arms. Three months, I have been on some short leave with the guys. Had a few beers, but don't worry, I'm keeping everything ready for you. If you catch my drift, <laughs> someone was hungry. Great, of all the places I'm gonna die on, Bonafide ghost ship. Okay. What else do we have here? Real, real creepy. Okay, nothing.
Oh, look at this. Hey, look what I found over here. Okay, we need something. Can I take that thingy off? That would be nice to lose the screws, but probably I cannot take it off. <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant. Well, you are not stupid. That's me. That's my hey, title. Look. I can't get it open. Hey, come here. Okay, what? Maybe we can bend if it If they're stirring that shit, it will oh, open or what? Know what? Where a vent like this would go. Wherever it leads, it can't be worse than here. You want me to just smash through this wall? Oh yeah, sure. Big man on campus. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Yeah, okay. Conrad, you do it. Timbers, you one-legged fuck faces! Yeah, no, you. I'm gonna rip your pirate pants off your shoulders and stomp them into rainbow-colored stew. I'm warning you. I am an American citizen. You really want my president coming after you guys? Because he will. Each and every one of you, personally. Hey, can you hear me? I I'm talking to you. Hello? Maybe they are already dead. All right, he is shocked. Let's see, what do we have here? Double guard duty on all doors and then all watches. I think I'm taking here an unnecessary risk, but and then there's the mystery of the Smith. What the? Stupid rat! Ah! <laughs>
Let's get the hell out of here. Catch up to the others. What? Have you seen the girl? I just want to know where the hell they all went. There should have been dozens of people on board. Hundreds. Unbelievable. The bloody ghosts. Where's the you are here arrow? That was shocking. Okay, I think the shit start hitting the fan. Yeah, she was standing right next to the door. Okay, that's not going to be good. You think he's still on the Duke? You guys as good as mine. What is this place? Engine room? Well, is there anything we can use down here? We're gonna need the distributor cap back before we're gonna get out of here. Oh, this is nice. I wonder where everyone went. Maybe everyone's hiding in the hole for a big surprise party. Let's go. <laughs> time for this boy. <laughs> yeah, time for us Jackson noisy. Thursday 12, the skipper has killed the booze for this whole goddamn trip. There's nothing like being sober to make you realize just how quiet this ship is. There was a fight between the, those dumb smokes, or schmucks. Wilson and Anderson right after we sailed, but Ferris nipped that in the pod real quick, blah blah blah. 13th. Okay, Sunday, it's all off. The guy who was gonna help me get in the holes has been signed off sick. Doc Finley thinks he's some kind of flake, which might be true, but Miller says it's something else. Something weird about that place. Miller's kinda, kind of a twitcher. Wouldn't want to be caught in a pinch with him, that's for sure. New but is worse than the last one. Never listening to any dumb full idea from Paris ever, ever again. No, I want to. Oh, this is only that four pages. Well, probably. I 
Another premonition. Turn the light off. Shh. Everyone quiet. I think he's dead. Yeah, definitely. He's coming back. Unbelievable. Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas. Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. That is unbelievable. I don't like this ship. Uh, I don't think so. Oh, I swear we've been here before, Alex. Have you been leading us in circles? Come on, Daddy. No, we wasn't here. What the heck? Soup du jour, mademoiselle? As if you know your way around the kitchen. Hey, babe. Once we settle down, I will be your personal chef de cuisine. Although there is another picture. I 
Oh, the little brother. What the? What? What? There's something in here with us. Did, didn't you? I mean, did you hear anything? Yeah, I have heard it. All right, we should keep moving. I know I saw something. It was moving in the shadows. Rats. Probably just rats. I don't think so. Don't fucking laugh at me. What do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. Okay, no. This isn't working for me. What? Okay, that's gross caskets. And wow. That are the coffins. Not my scene, you know? You're right. It's gross and it's crappy. You gotta get out of here too sweet. And we gotta find Fliss. Okay, so can we just get the fuck out then? What is this? Don't open it, but they will anyway. What? <laughs> Vampire ghosts. Look at this. It's insane. Is it even human? I mean, was it ever human? Deal with this place. That is some bad mojo, dude. Okay, leave. Now. Leave, leave, leave. No, we're going to check the others. Hey, Brian Carter. This guy? And what are they even doing here? I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan, eh? Who cares where they're from or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. And that thing is changed, chained. Got some serious locks in these caskets. Why would they be chained? Okay. And locked? Well, that's one way to end a relationship. Look at this one, like for a kid or something. I don't want to know. Let's get out of here. Yes, maybe that's little baby Dracula, right there. And those are his parents, and they're lying in the dirt from their native country. And, and then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face. <laughs> the end. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Right, after we check this thing here. What the hell, man? Look! Oh! Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? Can we just get out of here? Ah, shocking! I'm not supposed to touch anything. Can we please hurry? I'm done sightseeing. Roger that. We gotta get Fliss. No time. <laughs> what was it? <laughs> what? Oh. Why so spick and span? Ah, oh, that's the first date. There is another creature with two hats. Fuck. Fuck. What the? This is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. I can't take it. I'm not supposed to touch it. I don't know. Let's fucking do it. Oh, what the fuck? Don't touch it. Why did you touch it? All right. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Connie? Connie? Where the hell did she go? Connie, where the fuck are you? Where is Conrad? He must have gone on ahead. Connie? Yeah, where bloody Conrad is? Hey, Conrad! Okay, let's play dumb. Where the hell did he go? Where 
Where this bloody guy just disappeared? Maybe he turned into a rat. That's not gonna be good. But you were the first who climbed in. I don't know why he's complaining about it. Let's check it again. And G, madam. What was that noise? What are you talking about? I don't want to hear anything from you. Olsen! What? I hate these Please, bloody jump scares. Of course you have. Huh. Where did all your friends go? I don't know what the fuck this is all about, but we gotta keep moving and find Olsen. Now! Olsen? Man. Oops, there was something. Why are you so dick? I wanted to check that picture. Dead end. It's not good. What the hell? Oh, 
What? No, there is a necromancer, or... Honestly. It's locked. That is shocking. That that shit was opened when we came. Bloody hell. I hate button smashing. Hello? Is anyone there? And the darkness will look back. <laughs> ah! oh. <laughs> Okay, that's just a very good guess. <laughs> Bastards. All right. That can be a good sign. Sing a song out. No, I, I don't want to sing any song. That would be more of the horror. Okay. Charsty Perez, Rex Perez. Okay, let's get. What the? Wow. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Fuck. There's the boy. No, you don't want to go in there. Technically, she just had to climb up here, and we are out. Hmm. Oh my goodness. Hello? Yeah, this hello. Hello. This can't be good. Oh. 
Okay, here is the bracelet. This is Julia's. They were here. Okay. They were here. Okay, other way. Sounds like in hell. Each of them had a heart attack. Should I go there? Of course. U.S. Central Infantry, 14th Division. Okay, that was close. Who's that? Who's there? Get away! Wait, I need to see the other side. Did not check it. We are able to pick up indirect messaging traffic until 0140. However, there has been no further incoming message track at all since that time. Mm. All right. You promise you stay dead? I definitely would take that thingy. Good boy. You're not supposed to be out here. I'm not supposed to see this. All right, I need to jump down. God damn it. Stay dead. Alex? Okay, it's not going to be good. Oh, you... Wow. 
Wow. What the? Oh my. What is going on? <laughs> Could be a bullet what killed him. Let's follow the ghost. What? You bloody kidding me? That must be hell. Wow. What in God's name is this? Search the bar room to find the others. Uh, I rather not. Can I just leave? All right. A pentagram. I wonder what is going on here. Hmm. There's gonna be something inside. Ah, uh, okay, nothing. That is just crazy. Oh. Let's see what do we have inside? Necromancy or black magic or whatever. Kabal should silently assemble and no more or fewer than five true individuals. Of some mind and spirit, it should number three female and two male. Firstborn faces. So that's why we are here. Hmm. Uh, 
Okay, so we are part of some sort of ritual. I'm just buying uh prepared for it in some way maybe. I will try Skull Dagger Blood Tree. I'm gonna go to the pentagram and see if I can touch it, but probably not. I cannot do anything with it for some reason. See the footsteps. I've never been there. Oh well. There's a coffin. Ho, 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 ho. Oh well. Let's see. I think the girl going to be inside. No. Oh! Okay, try again. Okay, nothing else. Now that would be the time to jump into the sea or ocean. <laughs> what is happening? logged <laughs> there was someone in the uh, background Wow, he almost killed us. What the fuck? He must be hallucinating. Who the fuck is that? Oh, that's... That's the bloody guy. Okay, here is the premonition.
Up, up, up. Okay, what is happening? You kidding me? <laughs> you should get more What? You You okay? No, she is not okay. What the heck? Guy is crazy. But you wanted to surprise me with the whole pirate adventure thing, and I gotta say it was a good idea. No, it was. I mean it's funny. I think it's funny, but I think the guys you hired are taking it a little too far, maybe. And don't be cheap. I mean, you didn't feel like paying top dollar, and that's... All right. You get, you get these guys Sounds a wee bit gone. They're taking it a little too far. You know, you get my drift? So if you want to feel like... <laughs> exactly. That guys. is never when I need it. I mean, these guys are fucking crazy. They're chasing us around the ship. <laughs> okay, that's not good. Run for your life! Alex! Julia! Oh, I gotta find her. Need something. It's, something is fucking... It's gonna be good for a fight. Of course, I'm not going to take. What? Okay, get the hell out of here. Yeah, I should really take a look behind this door, shouldn't I? Should. But should I? Yeah. I should. <clears throat> you 
You're kidding me. What? All right. So how do I pry the son of a bitch off? <laughs> I think, yeah, I need that bloody cross. I gotta find something to pry the door open. Okay. That's... If anybody knew what the hell was going on in this place, it would have been the captain. Hmm. Probably not much of a practice with the preach kind of guy. Okay. That should do the job. It's got some half to least. Enough of the door. What the hell? No. That's crazy. <laughs> oh my! Press the wrong button. Oh. Jeez, man. The fuck? <laughs> no. Unbelievable. <laughs> Fucking climb. Sure, done. You're kidding me. My goodness, let's confront. Oh. 
Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, she has a nice beard. Almost bigger than mine. Come on! What's going on? Hey, sis, what's up? Out of the way! Holy moly! Okay, we gotta get team is together. At this point, I just would jump on the boat and go wherever. There's the radio. No, no, no. Good, I, think. I did not. I did not shave it. I still have it. I'm thinking about it. Oh, hello. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. Let me help you out. Give you a little hint. All right, give me a hint. Okay, give me a hint. Well then, how can I put this? There may be forces at play here that are more scientific and even some that are more political, you know? Less supernatural. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go there was on, no tragedy. To it. Speak soon. There was no tragedy. At all. What the 
hell is wrong with you back there? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking... Come on, no. No, come on, that's ridiculous. What the fuck is going on with this ship? Because, I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were <coughs> bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and... That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. I saw something. This, uh, uh, this old lady. I mean, she was batshit crazy and, like, dinosaur old. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... Let's time out, okay? This place is too fucked up to just be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, something is going on here. So what do we know for sure that we can all agree on? <laughs> Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? Like, ghost ships are real and this is one and we're totally on it and oh, holy shit, we're so totally fucked? I was gonna say the same thing. Well, I know we're not the first people to see weird shit here. Apparently the guards were super freaked out by something they saw in the cargo holds. We found a note that said a bunch of guys tried to get out of guard duty because they were really freaked out by something. What do you think actually happened to this place? A goddamn mystery box is what it is. It looked like the newspaper was from 1947. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, I weird. think we don't need the gold. And I don't like it. Just get the hell out it's of like here. This place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big floating coffin. So what's with the bodies? They come with the ship? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're yeah. not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. Yeah. If we can find it and use it, that's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. Well, the Duke of Milan has a ship. Uh, sorry, has a radio. That's stupid. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. They were shooting something. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. these if they weren't Swiss cheese. Find a way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Oh my. Gas mask instruction. have been moving some pretty dangerous cargo. Mm-hmm. 
I seriously just would jump off, find the Duke of Milan, and then use the radio there. Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. Why a girl? I'll pull you up. Okay, where did she go? What the hell? Chase Conrad before. Huh. I, I thought it looked familiar. Over here. Just leave that shit. Gotta wait for Honestly, me. this game is stupid. Hey, Cherry. This game is real stupid. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, so there is no way out. Fantastic. Oh, my. Okay, he killed himself. Yeah, it's kind of. The same, same thingy. No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Hmm. What the heck? Uh, ship was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. <laughs> I did not see a mermaid. We saw some uh, female with a nice beard. Some old female. But not mermaid just yet. Take a look. Okay, here is the radio. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working! It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's have some for help. Hmm. Hey! Hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Uh, Holy shit! We got him! Uh...
If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees 30 minutes south, 151 degrees 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. What the? This is an emergency. Please help. Hello. Hello. Is anyone out there? Please come in. Under it, you just died. That's bollocks. Yo, guys, check it out. Still, would be better to go back somewhere. on the Milan. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I gotta be honest. I don't think I'm gonna make it down there in my shape. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? Stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the pitcher's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? I got... I got this. I'm not losing you to this fucking ship. I'm coming too. Hey, what? No, 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 no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this. Trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. Ah, uh, she right. doesn't want to go. You and me, Julia. I think she doesn't want to go. <laughs> oh yeah, she handled it very well. God damn it. No, that was stupid. Okay, she's injured, probably. Any broken bones? Everything still work? You guys okay down there? I'm okay. So, what's next? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Copy that. Wait up here by the radio. Here. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> After you. Okay, I don't know which way we should go. Okay. Not that way. Looks like we're in the lower levels of the ship. What the heck is that? So it looks like there was some sort of fight and this Charlie went to the brig. Day sentence. <laughs> Must have been a big fight. Hmm. Maybe the whole shit started because of the argument between the two. Medical of officers report. Okay, what the Western world should be protected from? <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so the Manchurian gold is a, basically a drug. Okay, that's all happened because of that drug. That was leaking out at the beginning. That's got into the water. Hmm. The name Joe was in the sick bay. Okay. I know what is going on here. That's why we are seeing things. I'm gonna need a hundred hot baths if we ever get out of here. We're gonna get out of here, Julia. I hope you're right. I might have a run. That's the boy. Might have been the son of someone on board. There's the dock. Okay. Hmm, invisible war. So we need to go down. Come take a look. Look, down there. I think that's the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Let's find out. Oh my. Shit. <coughs> no more ladder. I can drop the rest of the way. Wait. <coughs> Are you okay? Yeah, fine. Come on down. But now there is no way back. <laughs> what the? You didn't fucking see that? Right. Okay, that's the drug. Of course you didn't. Um, hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seeing clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. So. The ship was carrying Manchurian gold, but that was really some sort of hallucinogenic bioweapon developed in China during World War II. We know it was unstable and leaked all over the ship. Maybe it's still here, and it's having the same effect on us. Exactly. Paranoia, hallucinations. That was what this stuff was designed to do. The crew was hallucinating. We know they were scared of something, and the officers thought it was just a bunch of jumpy GIs trying to get out of guard duty. All this crazy shit going on, none of it's real. None of it's actually there. If you would have a gas mask, that, that could help. We know the plane was here, and we know the ship shot at it. it. Must have been a result of the psychosis. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. When wind engine works, Rotterdam, Netherlands, diesel engine number 1734, year 1920. You ever wonder what would have happened if we went to Japan? 
plan a vacation instead. Shut up. I don't know if I'm going to the right way, but... Hey, look at this. The rebreather. I bet the fisherman brought it from the Duke. You think it still works? Uh, it's got maybe a few minutes of air left. Worth taking with us? It's just gonna slow us down. No, take it. No, we should take it. Parts of the ship are completely underwater. <laughs> oh my god, how did he die? I, I don't know. You think they're turning on each other? Oh, there is the... That is the stuff we need. Wow. I don't know. He's There's still no taking that it, shit. You little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deal? <laughs> you can't have all the gold. Then I'm to be left here to die. Run! 
Come on, push that bloody door! Unbelievable. We're good. We're, we're now. Holy fuck. None of you move. None of you go on changing on me now. Turn around. Slow. Real slow. I think need to play along along with him. Put the gun down now. Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you breathed in the mist. It's happening. I can feel it. Okay. Look, there was something in the last room. A, a, a fog or a mist, maybe? Inside of us. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. Jeez. You're holding your breath right now. Wait, 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 wait. We have a rebreather from our boat. What? We've been using it to get the mist out of us. You know, we could use it on you too, okay? No, 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 no! You keep that thing away from me! Oh, good. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? No! It's in me, isn't it? Uh, uh, I can't feel it swirling around in there! It's changing me! But the inside... No, man. There's, there's no mist inside you, I can tell. Stop! Stop lying! You can all see it in me, can't you? You're just lying! The mist is inside! Keep me alive! <laughs> what the hell? What should I do? All right, nothing. Oh, fucking shit. But now we have a pistol, so we can shoot down that bastard. Fuck. It's bloody empty. Hmm. I did not want to fail, uh, grab the pistol because of uh, in case I ruin it. Great. Let's just fucking do 
fucking great. We could be dead. Yeah, sure. Let's just start drowning ourselves in puddles now. Why not? There's 472 rivets in this room, which can only mean one thing. Honestly, I've been in here way too long. None of them thinking of that. Hey, we should go on the Milan. Because maybe we cannot leave. But there is a radio. Which is operating. I don't know. Shit. This is just dumb. You're gonna stay here with the radio. I'll go after them. No. I'm a big boy. Don't go, you moron. Ah. Good luck down there. Honestly, this is so unnecessary. He could be dead because of that guy with the hammer. And probably he will be. Because of he's going to hallucinate again. That is so stupid. Honestly, he's absolutely stupid. I think he deserves to die. Yeah, like like some movies indeed. Hmm. This is so stupid. Yeah, that's exactly that. And go there, where the mist is even deeper. Okay, these are the containers. Just leave him alone. Hey, it's cool, man. We're cool. We can talk this out, man. We can bond over how much we hate this boat. Really? So you think that's the best solution here? That's not good. Oh, 
Fuck me! Yeah, that is that shit. Get out of there! Come on! No fucking way! Where do you have to? I don't know. No fucking way! Uh, I couldn't press fast enough this shit. That's why I hitting button smashing rubbish. That's just stupid. Ah, oh, god damn it! So unnecessary. From now on, I don't even care. <laughs> but as I said, he was looking for it. And that's right at the end. The damage is done. All right. Let's try it. The same here, same here. After this, I go to sleep. He was an asshole. Was. Honey meant well. No matter what moronic thing he was up to, he always meant well. It's just a big old puppy dog. Just trying to make everyone laugh. I don't think so. They ever gonna go to. Diving again, looking for treasure.
Why he smiling? Why why he was smiling? He is disappointed. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again. See if you can't do better next time around. Impressive. Almost everyone survived. Almost. Yeah, that's the problem. The bloody almost. I suppose when the curtain falls, you're either ready for it or you're not. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. Wow. Till we meet again. Maybe in Little Hope, maybe somewhere else. Somewhere else. Certain. We will meet again. <laughs> I don't know. This is a promise or a, a bloody tre threat. <coughs> Dri driving to Atlantis. Or maybe just not. Because <coughs> there is no Atlantis just yet. So maybe next time it's it could be until down, which was one of the which was the first, I think. What is happening here? Oh, he woke up. He wasn't actually dead. Uh, they don't have their gas mask. That's gonna be a nightmare. So out of nowhere, this thing just sent out an SOS. Guess we got a real life ghost ship here. Huh? And they just sent in two soldiers. Now you say devil. Whoa. Devilinas. What the? Okay. I just saw someone in the woods. Whoever it was, they're gone. All right, that was done. Okay, very good. Who's there? I fashioned her with my own hand. Okay, well, that was it. The Man of Medan was pretty good. Almost a successful story, almost. So maybe next time, maybe next time, yeah. Uh, devil, devil in us. All right, guys, thank you very much. Have a good night, be good. Stay safe and thank you be here to be here. Bye bye.